Hello guys and welcome back to the episode of Dark Souls. Um So yeah, we went around there, I died as you guys saw, I dropped down there, got the chest over there. Pretty much just go across there down there, go there, 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 that's all we need to know. It's pretty it's pretty much easy to figure out. Once you just drop onto the statue and go across. I think you guys saw me do it or did I cut it out, I'm not sure which. I tried to make tried to, I had to cut something out because it was going over the 20 minute time limit, which I wanted to try and keep it under. Anyway. I can't remember what I'm doing. I'm gonna go downstairs. What was that? Hello! You can't hurt me, silly gargoyle. Um, I can't remember where I'm going right now. It's gone and gone. It's just. I remembered just for a second, now it's just gone. I think there's a boss fight down here, actually. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh, my heart. That scared the living crap out of me. Okay, the boss room's not that way, it's a different way, but you do something with this and then you can go to the boss room. I just can't remember how you did it. Oh shit, he's here now. Run! I should really close my door, it's getting cold in there. Fuck, um... Can I get his tail? Can I get your tail? I want your tail. Bad gargoyle! Give me your tail before I end up killing you. Oh. Oh, I got his stuff anyway. Okay, sweet. You can now. There is a way to get to. There is a boss room somewhere. It's an optional boss. You don't have to do it, but I kind of want to do it. <coughs> oh. Oh. <coughs> oh. <laughs> it's disgusting. Choking on my own saliva. <laughs> Fuck. Man down! Man down! Is it in here? No. But it's stuff in there I want, I fire McCready. Oh look, it's the bodies I knocked down. Who's throwing knives at me? Ow. They hurt! Nice hurt, stop throwing them at me. I think my sword's stronger. Well, you got knives. I'm kind of... Yeah. You, I've got an unfair advantage, I'll admit. I'm surprised I put nothing on my bar yet. I mean, I've got eight humanity on the go, and I've got... I might learn a bit of magic in this playthrough as well. I don't know if I can be pyromancy. I think, it's, I think I will learn pyromancy since I've already started grading the pyromancy hand. Um, but as far as I haven't put anything on here yet, the bar and stuff. Oh, probably because there's nothing to put on the bar in the first place. And probably I'll probably get to like a poison place, I might put some poison cure things on the go, I don't know. I make this stuff as I go along, guys, I really do. It's my memory sucks, and I'm sorry if I've stopped all of a sudden, I am just looking at the time, okay. I think my eyesight might be actually getting worse, or it's just I'm tired. I'm not sure which. Probably because I'm tired, I... Eyesight's actually improved. Which I'm very grateful for. I've knocked the mic again, shit. I think that's fine. Yep, yeah, it's fine. I'll put that. Stop! Sure, I'm just gonna run for this room so I wanna clear it as quick as I can. Let's go. Okay, you guys. Come get me. Yeah, I need you to come at me. Come on, run! Stop throwing knives and come at me! There we go, got another bit of humanity there. Oh yeah, if you see like the difference between the white lines sometimes come to me and every now and then I get a black line come to me. 
That's because there's humanity and you're gaining humanity as well. I still think the humanity system on Dark Souls 1 is better than the effigy system on Dark Souls 2. Just say that now. The co op is a lot easier on to get to connect to on the second one, but it's, the effigy system sucks. I don't like it. They've tried to make it harder, but in the end they just failed. But you had a great. It was a good game, but it was too easy in Dark Souls 2. Then they made Scar of the First Sin Edition, and they made it shit. Instead of making the enemies harder, they just threw more in there. Which I think was the wrong call. Don't just get lazy and throw a handful of any extra enemies in there. Actually make them harder. Stop dodging me! Die by my blades! Yeah, stop, stop targeting him please, I need heal. Thank you. Charge! Throwing knife. Throwing knife too. I think that's them all. Probably one in the corner over there. Um, I will do the DLCs as well. I will try and do all the areas. Because I really like this game, so I really want to do all the areas. Um, the optional bosses. So, for everyone, yes, I will be going to the Painted World. Yes, I will be going to the DLC area. Because normally I would have killed um, the boss called Seath by now, but... I don't want to kill him right now. But you need something to get in there, I forgot what it's called. I forgot I need to go back to the Asylum to go in there. I can't remember from the top of my head, I'll figure it out as I go along. But yeah, I gained armour, but it's armour I didn't actually want. Okay, I thought it was a different set. I'm sorry, I wasted a bit of time there. I might actually cut this bit out, I'm not sure if I should yet. I might not, I might keep it in case you want to find that set. It's a good set. For this, if you want to be a warrior or something at this stage. It's a nice set for that. But... What am I? What did I choose? Did I choose warrior? Or did I choose knight? I can't remember what I chose. I think I'm not going to bother. If I want warrior, I'm going to go for like a swordsman or something, a lighter class. Because I'm not a big fan of slow, heavy... Tanky classes, they really piss me off. It's just because they're slow. I don't like slow classes. I want to be able to move quick. Hence, I got the stamina shield on to boost my stamps so I can roll quicker. Oh, wait, this is a this bit that's a bitch. I forgot about this bit. Wait, can I, got, I got a bow. Okay, it's fine. I can do this. Headshot. 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 Hey, I thought, these things have a really weird weakness as well, I remember that. It's their foot. If I can hit it. Yeah, their foot is their weakness. Figure that one out. Unless it's just a slight error, or it's foot's close. I'm not sure which hat is for what's happening with the ankle. It's just... It, it, it does more damage there for some reason, I don't know. This is supposed to be a reference to one of those old mythical legends. It might be. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Tell me if, it, if anyone if you haven't figured out by now, I'm a big fan of like mythological and like legend-based stuff, which is why I really like the um, TV show Merlin. Any of you seen that? Please t say it in the comments. I really enjoyed that show, actually. It's finished now, but while it was still there, I loved watching it. One of my favourite shows to date. So I watched it when I was younger, and it never really interested me back then, but as I got older, I kind of really went back and rewatched every episode of it, back to back. This is during when I was back at college, so, you know. 
I have the time. I really love that show, it was great. It's a shame it ended, I wanted more, I really did. I wanted like an extra season. But at the same time, they wouldn't have made it work, I don't think, if they did. So I'm kind of, so it kind of pissed me off at the end, ended there at the same time I was happy. Who the fuck is shooting at me? It's the one from over there, I can't see you. Oh my god, it's a phantom! Run! I shouldn't really say phantom on this because the phantoms are fucking players. <laughs> it's a ghost, there we go, it makes more sense. Ow. Oh shit, no, I remember. I remember why I hate this bit. Yeah, I remember why I hate this bit, because you get staggered. Like, oh, balls here! I remember why I hate that bit now. I remember why I fucking hate it. It's not the enemies are hard, it's just the number of them. And the fact when they start hitting you in sync, that's it, you're fucked. You can't escape because you've been constantly staggered and that's it, you're gone. It's the only proper dark of the multiple enemies hit you, they stagger you and you're done for. Right, I'm gonna get back there then. Okay, we're back now guys. Um, yeah, I've killed them. I just stood back and bowed them. <laughs> Couldn't be asked, I didn't have fighting them. Right, oh god. Oh god, I remember this bit. I hate this, I hate this bit. I remember it. I remember it. Because these guys are both assholes. Okay, I can't hit him from here, but it does really, really a small amount of damage. Great. I'll slow it a bit so I can actually hit him all the time. There we go. I'm gonna. I recommend this now. If you get to this point, make sure you kill one of them because if you don't kill one of them, it's really pot luck to try and get past this area because they'll both bow you simultaneously, and that's it. You're stuck, and they'll eventually knock you off the edge, and you'll fall to your death. So either way, bow one of them down. This part has killed me so many times because I never bowed them down. I just ran straight up. And try to fight them up there to try and get past them. Or just try to block all this stuff and run past. You'll see why in a minute. I'm just recommending now you kill this one. Actually, if you can kill them both from here, save yourself the time of effort and the fucking peril you're gonna face. You dead yet? No, this one should kill you. See him, he's still there. Look at him. Looking all high and mighty up there. Ship down the cover. Ooh. Okay, he shot another one. He shot another one. You gonna let me fast? Nope, so apparently walls can block everything. Oh, for fuck's sake. I know I'll be back. In a few minutes again. <laughs> God damn it, I hate this area so much. Okay, so I've got my souls but now I've killed one of the archers. Alright. Now it's really just potluck. As I said, really just pot luck, because he's just going to keep bowing me now. Oh wait, no. 
I forgot to fight this guy. Fuck off! Oh, that was it. Okay, I, I remember. Make him suffer for his mistakes. <laughs> if he misses, you hit him. <laughs> if he misses again, you hit him some more. Make him suffer for every time he misses you. Right. Sort of a hero. Oh, this is a pain in the ass. I really hate this area. I've said that many times, I really do. It's not because Analondo sucks, it's just this part of Analondo that sucks. <laughs> the bit where you have to go through to open it up. Once it's open, it's fine, but once it's flipped and still clocked off, it sucks. Fuck it. And there should be a bonfire somewhere around where I can end the episode, I hope. Because I really need to get in the week. Yeah, oh, there's a solar head. Solar's here as well. Sweet one. Oh, there you are. You've been quiet these days. Smooth summoning out there. Anytime you see my brilliantly shining signature, do not hesitate to call upon me. You've left me with quite an impression. I would relish a chance to assist you. It's all right. Yeah, I'll summon you next time, mate. You really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? So I like if you. I You're really good. Better, I think you have feelings for me. Oh, no. Dear me. Pretend you didn't hear that. <laughs> you really are fond of chatting with if I don't oh, no. <laughs> Okay, exhaust this dialogue. There is a story behind him as well. And I don't have enough time to explain it, so Thank you guys for staying with me for this series so far. I um, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button, it really helps me out a lot. And as always, cheers for watching.